Hey friends, this is Latif Opier. Well and welcome to the new update on Bitcoin. This video is very important because in this video, I'm going to explain why this triangle is very, very important, even though this is a very small time frame, a four hour time frame chart where we have this triangle formed. But if Priceline breaks down the support of this triangle, that can be really devastating for Bitcoin. And if Priceline breaks out the resistance, that can be a start of a very, very big move. But before starting the analysis, if you are not subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe. And for more ideas, you can also support me here at the Patreon because here I'm sharing different trading ideas for you. And you can find the link to join me here in the video's description I've shared. And I'm just going to start from the weekly time frame. And here you can see uh, very obviously I have uh, mentioned all these things, which I, I want to show you. I want to tell you in this chart. Uh, on this chart, you can see that we have a $28,600 support level. And almost in my every previous video, I've been telling you that this is the key support for Bitcoin. We need to save this support. And you can see whenever Bitcoin is touching this support, like uh here we had several touch points when we had this rally after testing this support we had big rally again we formed a double bottom at this support and we had another rally and right now we have tested the support here and right now we are still moving above this support and it is possible that we may start another rally from here because you can see here I have shown that the price line has formed another lower than previous low. Here we have the recent low, uh, the previous low, and here we have the most recent low. And you can see here what stochastic oscillator is doing. Stochastic is setting a higher low than previous low. So there is a very big bullish divergence flashed on the weekly time frame. And while we are above this support of $28,600 and this bullish divergence has flashed and the stochastic is completely oversold and in this situation this bullish divergence can be a very very big signal for any price reversal from this support now let's move back to that small time frame chart and here we can see that uh, bitcoin has formed this descending triangle we are continuously getting rejected by this resistance we are rejected here here and uh, here and here and here and right now we are moving at the center of the triangle and we have uh, several touch points at the support as well and you can see recently we have bounced from this support here and the, the support of this triangle is exactly at the same level where we have this very, very big key support of $28,600 that we were watching here. And now let's take a look at the target. And I'm not expecting that if Bitcoin breaks down the triangle, then it will only hit this target. I'm expecting even more bearish move. And if uh, Bitcoin will break out, then I'm expecting more bullish move that uh, that will be very, very big from the target that I'm going to show you in case of breakout. Now, in case of breakdown, you can see that it is showing us the projection to the downside up to $25,114. But you can see in case of breakdown, we will lose this support of $28,600. That will be that is a key support right now. And after breaking down, uh, let me to take you to the weekly time frame chart once again. You can see we are very close to this red line. That is a 200 weekly simple moving average. And this is the previous high of $20,000 that we had previously back here back in December 2017. So if we will lose this support of $28,600, then we can also test this 200 uh, weekly simple moving average. And we all know that whenever price line since it has appeared in 2015 whenever price line uh, test this support here you can see here if we had we had bounce here we had bounce every time we are we are having nice big bounces uh, bitcoin never breaks down this support of 200 simple moving average yes it is possible that we may have a bit longer spike up to this previous high that will be twenty thousand dollar now right now we can see the value you can watch the value by the way here of this 200 weekly simple moving average that is at twenty one thousand nine hundred and fifty eight dollars as per the bit stamp exchange and uh, very very close to twenty two thousand dollars and this is the support of twenty thousand dollars so it is possible that we may have a spike like 
uh, when we tested this support here back in March 2020, then we had a long spike. Uh, we had the 200 simple moving average here at $5,500 and we had a spike up to uh, $3,850 uh, $3, but recovered back very soon. We did not break it down. So it is possible that we may test this 200 simple moving average and we will also have a spike up to that level. But I'm not expecting that we will only hit the target of $25,000 in case of breakdown. Now in case of break out this triangle, uh the realistic target according to this tri the triangle can be approximately at thirty-four thousand dollars. but in that situation you can see we already have this very very big bullish divergence and this move this breakout can provide a very very big push to the price line that can the, uh, can be the first step towards a very big move because uh we can see that we also have a down trend line resistance as well that is in fact the resistance of the falling wedge pattern and let me to copy this trend line from here or just going to i'm just going to place a trend line here at uh, thirty four thousand dollar then you can see that is below this resistance of uh, uh, this down trend line that is the resistance of the falling wedge pattern and after breaking down breaking out this thirty four thousand dollar you can see this level has been breaking as a support here as well there is a very high probability that the price line may also break out this resistance of the falling wedge uh, let me do place uh, the support of the wedge as well here we have the support you can see that we are having very nice bounce right now and in that situation the price line can break out this wedge and the target of the wedge can be here at the top of the wedge at approximately sixty eight thousand dollar but you can see every time bitcoin is forming higher highs so i'm expecting if we will break out this wedge in case of breaking out this wedge uh, bitcoin can form another higher than previous high because there is also a very very big bullish divergence up, uh, appeared or flashed on this chart on this weekly time frame that can be the big reason for this very very big reversal so we need to keep an eye on this triangle this is very important and this can be the really make or break time for bitcoin and it is very important for us to break out this triangle as soon as possible. And you can see it is quite squeezed. So within the next few hours, it can be confirmed whether are we going to move more down from here or we are going to set another higher than previous high. So this was the update so far. I hope that you have liked the analysis. Then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well. And for more ideas, you can also support me at the Patreon because here I'm sharing different trading ideas for you. And you can find the link to join me here in the video's description I've shared. Take care. Goodbye.